Hey what's going on guys this is Kedar here. Today in this video how you can know if someone is using your social security number that is SSN. You'll check out the telltale sign that your social security number has been hacked and what would you do if someone is using your social security number. How to tell if someone is using your social security number or not. And if you are getting a doubt that your personal information is in wrong hands well here are some telltale signs to know that your social security number has been hacked. So if you feel like your SSN is stolen, how can you know if someone is using your social security number? We will cover 7 telltale signs so you can know someone is using your SSN or not and you know a stolen SSN could cause endless headaches. So it is very important you act as soon as you can as you notice someone is using your social security number. Any delay could mean loans taken out on your name or stolen tax refund. In other words, hours of your time will be lost during the process. So guys, before we start this video, make sure to subscribe to our channel for latest useful videos like this turn on that bell notification so you will never miss our latest videos make sure to hit that like and with that being said let's get right into it so well your ssn is your key to your identity and that's why it's so vulnerable and if a hacker gets a hold of it they can able to crack open most of the secure accounts and wreak a havoc on your life but how do you really know if someone is using your social security number well first as soon as hacker have access to your your SSN well they will have a ability to access your bank account also they can open new bank accounts in your name open lines of credit card also they can obtain your tax returns take loans use your health coverage and open utilities and membership in your name but unfortunately not everyone knows when they have been a victim of social security number identity theft in order to stay safe and protect your privacy you need to learn how to tell if someone is using your social security number or not and if you are getting a doubt that your personal information is in wrong hands well here are some telltale signs to know that your social security number has been hacked now unfortunately there is no easy one click way to check if your ssn is being abused by hackers you need to do a little check and stay aware of your financial health but here are some indicators that someone is using your social security number and speaking of the first telltale sign you can see unexplainable changes in your credit score your credit score is what helps your banks and lenders to determine what risk they will be facing if they decide to lend you money because that is based on your track record as it shows them how likely you are to pay back the loan also different financial factors influence your credit score but thankfully you can check it to see how you are doing financially so you can make corrections where it's necessary and if you check your credit score information and you notice accounts that you didn't initiate well then you are probably a victim of ssn theft one another sign is that if you are turned down for a new New credit application even though you have had a great credit before in that case you can consider the changes and consider that your ssn might have stolen and speaking of the second telltale sign inaccurate banking information almost any social security number identity theft aims to steal your money this is another excellent way to check if you have been hacked or not and therefore when your bank statements come in be sure to look through them carefully and if you see the payments for any subscription that you didn't make it's possible you your ID isn't just yours anymore. And well, if you noticed a small taste charges on your credit or debit accounts, well, that may be a sign if someone is attempting to open a new account or membership in your name. And speaking of the third telltale sign, changes in your email or snail mail. Another tactic most of the scammers and hackers use is to watch your email. If they got access to your emails by some way or another, anything vulnerable or the information they came across, they steal it as soon as it comes in their hands. So well, if you are noticing any changes in your email such as not receiving bank statements or invoices this could be a sign that you have been a victim of identity theft using your ssn and among the others two major types changes that are possible well the first thing could be that you may stop receiving the email notification for the purchases that you make and second you might also start receiving the notification for purchases that you didn't actually made and that could include mail arriving to your house address to strange people and once people use your ssn to sign up for your accounts well that can lead to a bizarre snail mail trail speaking of the poor telltale sign well a false employment records well this one is another common practice ssn theft someone might use your social security number to get a job or to pass a background check but thankfully any earnings will show up on your personal statement and if you haven't already created an account at the official social security website to check all the income that has been posted to your number you can contact the social security administration 
information. Speaking of the fifth telltale sign, correspondence from the IRS. And before we go ahead to make this point, you should know that the IRS almost never calls people. And we can say why, but we don't know that they don't do it. However, barring any tax issues, it may be that you are on the receiving end of the SSN hack. And if you are getting your messages from IRS, chances are that they see suspicious transactions involving your social security number and may be contacting you about the potential case of identity theft. Picking up the sixth telltale sign, messages from credit agencies. Well, this is the surest sign of SSN theft. If your credit company calls you about an issue, someone may have opened another credit line with your SSN. And last one but not the least, a fraudulent tax return. That may be a sign, telltale sign of identity theft. Did you know that you can request your most recent tax transcript from the IRS? I mean, this is the easiest way to see if someone has submitted fraudulent tax return. It's easy to make a request via tax transcript tool on the IRS website. You can also make a request over the phone call or mail. So you can call the IRS at 1-800-908-9946 or send the IRS form 4506-T to get your transcripts by email. So well, what can you really do if someone is using your social security number? Well, a stolen social security number causes endless headaches. So it's very important you should act very soon as you notice someone is using your social security number. Any delay could mean loans taken on your account, stolen tax refund. In other words, hours of your time will be lost. And well, according to the Social Security Administration, they recommend following things. First, you can log on to your My SSN account to check your earning records and this will let you know if someone has been fraudulently using your SSN to get a job or take a loan and that kind of thing. Also second, if someone, if something looks fishy, go through the steps at the Federal Trade Commission's identity theft page and you can start the process of protecting yourself and taking back control and you can call the FTC at 1-877-438-4338 or you can submit it online. Also you can contact the SSA at number 1-800-269-0271 or you can alert them via IRS identity protection website so that no one files a tax returns and steals your refund. Also fourth, you may went on to file a police report in your local jurisdiction where the identity theft took place so that you have a record of the incident that may come in handy. So you can head over to identitytheft.gov to report an identity theft and get a recovery plan. They will help you each step to recover your account or you can head over to the irs.gov identity-theft-center. Here you can check out all the details what you can do if someone is misusing your social security number. That's how you can know if someone is using your social security number and what can you do if your SSN is stolen. How can you recover it back and all that. I hope this video was helpful. Make sure to hit that like, smash that like button that helps us a lot. Subscribe to our channel for more of this awesome videos. Turn on that bell notification and with that being said this is Kedar from How to Guys signing up.